Hello everybody, I hope everyone is having a great day. My name is Tom. In this part of the video, I will be creating a 1 minute video, to be used for my Final Cut Pro export to H.265 codecs. Final Cut Pro, on its own, is not capable of exporting a H.265 video. For this reason, I will be using Apple Compressor to accomplish this task. The DJI Go 4 app is being displayed. To show the camera set up to accomplish this task, encoding format set to H.265, color set to D log M, video size set to 4K, full field of view. So let's go ahead and start the video. While the video is being recorded, let's talk about why we are doing this. I am doing this to show that it is the drone that is doing the recording. I am only going to record for one minute. This is being recorded on my Mavic Pro 2 drone. Since this is only a one minute video, I have decided not to speed this up. Be patient, we're almost there. Only 48 seconds to go before I can stop this recording that I need in the next part of this demo. I would like to say, life is not easy being a robot named Tom. As bad as this narration seems to be, it is far better than the human creator of this how-to video could ever have been able to do. With all that being said, it is now time to turn this over to my human partner. Dave, who is my human partner, will be narrating the next part of this video. It is my honor to welcome Dave as our next narrator, and I'll be signing off for now. Hello, my name is Dave, and I'm going to attempt to export this Mavic Pro 2 H.265 video clip uh, and maintain its 10-bit HEVC settings. Uh, let's take a look at what I'm doing this with. It's a, I'm using Catalina. It's a MacBook Pro. 16 gigabytes of internal RAM. Um, not the fastest, most powerful thing in the world, but let's let's try it. See what happens. All right, let's take a look at our info inspector. See what we have here. It definitely is 4K. Definitely is HEVC. So we know it's 10 bit. That's what I set it at. Uh, all right, let's add a LUTs. Let me use this one. This is from the DGI site. That's what they recommend. Uh, not too bad. Um, all right, next, let's drop this down to the timeline. Keyboard shortcut E. Let's go into our inspector and let's stabilize it and let's add some vibrancy and sharpen it. Okay. We are there. Alright, let's just sharpen it a tad. Let's give it a little bit of vibrancy. Alright, let's just play a few seconds of this, see what it looks like. Well, not too bad. Pretty good, in fact. Alright, let's go ahead and try to export this puppy. We'll have to share. I've got this already installed, and I've used the uh, device uh, 4K HVC 10 bit. It's already installed. I mean, I, I can show you how I did it. This appeared in this window and I just drug it over and 
I added the uh, Apple device to it. It's not a really big hard thing to do. Alright, let's get out of there. Let's go back up here. Go here. Um, and yes, uh, we're correct there, we're correct there. It is a 4K movie, 24 frames per second. And it says we'll get 117 megabyte file. Let's go next. Okay, I want to take this to Camtasia outside. And we'll just leave it at H265. Save it. Uh, it's going to take a while for this. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is just pause it right now and come back when it's 99%. Uh, this laptop is not powerful enough for this, but, but I think it'll work. I'm going to go eat breakfast or lunch or drink a beer or do something. This is going to take a long time. All right, I'm back. It's at 99%. I can see that my CPU is really straining here. My six cores are working their butts off. Okay, sure is successful. All right, now that that's done, let's go ahead and get out of here. Let's go into our finder, and take a look at the files file. And I've got it here on my Sa Samsung. Uh, okay, this is the file that we got from the compressor. It is 119.8 megabytes. Uh, Alright. Let's... Well, the back port video was the original. Let's just take a quick look at that. Let's just play it for a second. Let's just take a look at what the inspector has to say for itself. Okay, as I said before, it is an HEVC 10-bit, H.265, same thing. Okay, right there. Uh, let's take a look at our finished product here, which is this one. Let's just play it for a second. Okay, looking good. Let's look at our inspector. Yes, it is HEV 10 bit. Uh, it is 4K. Cool, we we did it. Billions of colors. Get out of there. Get out of there. Okay, just a short clip to show the difference between the original Mavic Pro 2 video and the resulting compressor video that we developed through Final Cut Pro.